There are growing concerns tonight over an uptick in COVID-19 cases among USC students. Dozens more cases have popped up in the past week, and all of them are students who live off campus. KCAL9's Jeff Nguyen has more on what's being done now to curb the outbreak. Tonight, getting on the USC campus means going through a checkpoint that includes filling out an online questionnaire about COVID-19. Second year student Garrett Murphy can tell you why the precautions are so important. Uh, I actually ended up getting it in June. And he wasn't the only one. The university says in the past seven days, 43 cases have been identified and more than 100 students have been placed on quarantine. All of them from off campus housing. I have a couple of friends who are sick and they're um, isolating and quarantining and staying safe. So I think everyone's kind of on the same page that we got to work together to get through it. USC calls it an alarming increase just one week into the fall semester. We're seeing a lot of transmission through these smaller group gatherings um, where students are getting together and so forth. Students believe this recent party in the courtyard of an apartment complex may have been a contributing factor. It was like an eye roll, but honestly, I wasn't that surprised. You're risking your own self and like the others around you. The university hasn't been able to pinpoint the source of the outbreaks, but it's offering free testing on campus even to asymptomatic students, which Garrett Murphy ended up being. He had to quarantine at the USC hotel to protect his six roommates. You just like don't want to be the person that's causing harm to somebody else. Just be careful and uh, look out for fellow students and you know, our LA population for sure. In addition to the free screenings, the university is also offering housing to students who need to be quarantined. At USC, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News.